Let's see if we can push his dent in a little further. Crouching tiger hand. Yeah. Crouching tiger! What up, it's Chad Wildplay, and you guys are huge kung fu movies fans. So today we're gonna look at five kung fu movies, buy some real weapons, and test them out in real life. The first kung fu movie we are looking at is Game of Death, featuring Bruce Lee, where he's wearing that yellow jumpsuit and wields the yellow nunchucks. It's a classic. So I'm gonna see if I can find myself a pair of yellow nunchucku and that yellow jumpsuit. Okay, the closest thing I can find is this yellow dragon foam nunchucku for $7.95. This is gonna be perfect. Let's order it. Whoa, that came so quick. Quick as Bruce Lee. There they are, the yellow nunchuck. Yeah, we've got a golden dragon on there. Metal chain and metal ball bearing, so they'll swivel very easily. And they're extremely lightweight. I will not have any trouble. I hit the microphone. That's why you shouldn't be swinging weapons around in the house. Good thing these are foam. I won't hurt myself. I hit myself in the head, nice and soft. If I want to become Bruce Lee, though, I need to look the part. I can't be out there wearing this awesome shirt. This is a CWC Chad Walkplay shirt. If you guys want to get this shirt, you can click right here in this top corner. There's a little eye symbol right there. Otherwise, there's a link in the description below. Wait till the end of the video, though. Let me get a little more looking like Bruce Lee here. What do you guys say, huh? Since I'm a ninja, I just got to go like this. Wow. Pretty cool outfit, although this outfit is quite snug on me, guys. I'm a little too tall for it. It's very snug in a very certain place that's not very comfortable. So I don't think I'm gonna dress up like this outside. Before we go, you guys know that we've been having some troubles filming here because of our neighbors really not liking us using ninja weapons outside by the pool. So we've been trying to find a new place to film. Where are we gonna film today? I don't know. So I'm gonna go get V, I'm gonna go get Justin, and we're gonna go somewhere we don't know yet. We'll see you outside in one second. What movie is this, you guys? This uh, Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee. You got it. You Game got it. of death. Game of Game death. Game of death. <laughs> kick bump. Oh. All right. You missed the <laughs> kick bump. B. You missed the kick bump. B, yeah. kick bump. <laughs> yeah. You guys like Bruce Lee. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I like he's Bruce Lee. Great. Physically fit. He's intelligent. And he likes a very suave guy. His style. Oh, you like his yeah. style. Sounds like I should be jealous of this guy, yeah. huh? Yeah. Like really nice, lean. Body, oh. like a swimmer's body. Yeah, I'm, nice. I'm a great swimmer. I'm a great <laughs> swimmer. All I can say is uh, practice your nunchuck skills. V, where are your nunchucks? Uh... <laughs> oh. Yeah! Go, 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 go. Bruce B. Around, around the waist. Oh, that's my, my favorite move of these. Yeah. Right here, look. That's a V original. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna play some ninja baseball. Oh. oh, what is this, like one or two bananas? It's like a Siamese twin, oh. but I'm gonna separate them. Oh, that was barbaric. Oh, <laughs> the I was looking for this next weapon. I stumbled upon these crazy knives, you guys. Uh, I think these would be really, really good for a CSGO video. You guys have been requesting I do a CSGO video for a long time, so I'm gonna buy like 10 of these knives, I think. If we could hit our thumbs up goal, I always give you guys a thumbs up goal every video, and you guys always nail it. So let's see if we can hit 80,000 thumbs up on this video. And if we hit 80,000 thumbs up, I'm gonna buy like nine or 10 of these CSGO weapons and test them out in real life in a CSGO video. 80,000 thumbs up, let's do it, you guys. But 
let's jump into the next kung fu movie, which is one of my favorites, Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. This video contains a lot of awesome weapons, and so for this video, I'm gonna go with the Dao, which is like a saber that splits into two smaller blades. This weapon was seen in that fight scene between Michelle Yeoh and Zhang Zi. It's the first weapon you see Michelle using, and about halfway through using that weapon, she splits it into two different swords. All right, so the closest thing I can find here is from KarateMart.com. They have the Twin Tanto Ninja Sword for $24.95. So they actually appear to be a single blade and then can be split into two blades. So this should be pretty similar to uh, the way Michelle uses her blades in Crouch and Tiger Hidden Dragon. So let's get these and test them out in real life. Oh, what do we got here? We've got what appears to be a single sword. It comes with a strap. You can wear this across your back and it comes buckled in right here. Let's get it out and unsheath this sword. There we go. So yeah, if you hold them close together at first glance, this does look, look, look like to be a single sword, but you can split them in half just like so and you have double swords. So they don't fit together super well. Like they don't lock together or anything like that. So you do just have to hold them together yourself if you want to try to trick your opponent. Uh, what makes it look like it's just a single sword is that they have the half Tsusuba here, which is this, and you put them together like so. This is a cool blade though, very solid black, as looks like Chinese writing on there. You know, I don't know if that's Chinese or Japanese or Korean. You guys will have to let me know. Ooh, these do seem pretty darn sharp. These have a nylon grip going all the way around the blade here. They're pretty light, actually. Let's see now, how do I hold this? I think these should be on the outside, because that's probably gonna do a better job of protecting my hand. There we go, so I can Cool. All right, these are gonna be fun to test for real outside. I think these are gonna be able to destroy anything we put in front of them. Soda ninjas, fruit ninjas, you name it. So let's go ahead and jump outside. I'll see you guys out there in one second. Whoa, that fancy sword. <laughs> you guys are familiar with Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. Oh, oh yeah. One of my faves. Or should I say dragon? Dragon. Dra they don't like it when I say dragon. Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. 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 I think that's the pronunciation. <laughs> v, you're gonna be Zhang Z-E. Zhang oh. Z-Z. Z Z E Zang V E yeah. Zang V. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna be Zang V. Yeah. I'm gonna be Michelle Yo. Like, what's up, Yo, 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 Yo? Or 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 Chad Young Fat. Yeah. Ah. yeah like so in that awesome battle with Michelle versus Zang. Oh yeah. Michelle starts off with a single saber. During the fight, it turns into two sabers. <gasps> Whoa. Dude, that thing just That's so cool. Yeah. Two swords. Oh, this is made for us, Chad. Is it really? Is oh, it's like a couple sword. You know? Really if you move your fingers, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you go, now you hold it. Yeah, like for a wedding, you know, if you're yeah. a true ninja, you, prob right you probably want to request this instead of like the matching his and hers towels. Yeah. Right, right, you right. You want what? Matching swords. Matching his and hers swords. swords. Yeah. So here we're a team, yes. but we're also still individuals. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Challenge. And the next Kung Fu movie we are looking at is, nope, not that bell symbol, but that bell symbol reminds me to thank all you notification ninjas who have that bell symbol turned on down below. Why? Because you guys get here early, you leave me awesome comments while I'm hanging out with you in the comment section after every upload. I'm gonna be giving a bunch of you guys a shout out at the bottom of the screen down here at the end of this video, like I do every video. So thank you for having that bell symbol not only on, but with the ringing symbols on. Then you can get here and hang out with me. All right, the next Kung Fu movie we are checking out is Enter the Ninja. And now this movie has probably one of the funniest death scenes I have ever seen. And it involves a throwing ninja star. I do have a big collection of throwing ninja stars, but I want to try to use some stars that are similar to what's used in the movie. So let's jump online here. There we go. These look very similar to what's used in the movie. Ronin Warrior Throwing Stars for $14.95. You looks like you get three throwing stars. These are gonna be perfect. Let's order them right now. 
Enter the throwing stars. Inside the black box is a white box. Just kidding. You've got a sheath here. These are always cool because they attach to your belt. You can carry these around with you, but check your local laws and make sure that's okay. <laughs> Don't carry them to school or anything like that. That will get you in trouble, which uh, it did get me in trouble when I was in school. <laughs> So don't do that. We've got three ninja stars here. One, two, three. So these are about four inches across in diameter here. So you can kind of see how it looks on my hand. They are quite sharp, not insanely sharp. I like this little cutout in the middle here. That's pretty cool. And very happy we get three of these. So we are going to go outside and face off against the evil emoji water balloons. And I know some of you are like, but water balloons are so easy to pop. Why do you do those? Because in my opinion, they look the coolest when you throw ninja stars at them, gushing colored water coming out. I think it looks amazing. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's go outside and test these out. <laughs> Let's hear your Bruce Lee. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> but we are not doing a Bruce Lee movie right now. We are doing a 1980s classic, Enter the Ninja. And you may be wondering, Chet, but where's your weapon? Well, it's, it's right down here. Oh. Right down here in my little pouch. Dang. Oh, pop that baby open. Hidden, hidden dragon. Enter the ninja. <laughs> that movie too. Enter the dragon. Oh, I'm sorry. Enter the ninja. Enter the ninja. So many enters. So many enters. Uses ninja stars. Ooh. Just like us. These are very sharp. You want to be careful with these. Yeah. Do not look fun to get hit with. No, definitely not. V's got her backpack there. Yeah. Oh. You know, there is a very neat kit for it. For oh, you to have it oh, in look there. Look at that, look yeah. at that. Yeah. Yeah. Those ninja stars. Yeah. Yeah. You don't need school supplies in there. You need these. Back to school ninja stars. That's right. On sale now. Don't actually put these in your backpack. I don't want you guys getting in trouble at school. That's not good. I mean, that's that's what I used to do when I was in school. I'd bring these and get in trouble. Did, I mean, did was... your teacher or your principal called your karate teacher? Yes, the principal called my karate instructor and said, hey, uh, Chad's been bringing some ninja stars. <laughs> not what a master at a dojo wants to hear. Good job, Chad. Yeah. <laughs> well done. You have to protect yourself from those bullies like Justin. Yes, He's exactly. I was a huge bully. Yeah, back in the day. I was coming around and being like... <laughs> well, what do you say we test these out on some emoji ninja balloons? Oh, get those emojis. Oh, let's put them in my backpack and let's go. Yeah, let's do yeah, it. Let's get them in there. Do it. Back to school where ninjas rule. Pull out a ninja star. Here we go. I'll never forget this day. Two left still. <laughs> And the next kung fu movie we are checking out is Fearless, starring Jet Li. He uses a lot of great weapons in this video. One of them is the metal three-sectional staff when he's battling against a sword fighter. He does some pretty incredible moves with this thing that uh, I kind of doubt I'm gonna be able to repeat, but that's not gonna stop me from buying it anyway. Let's go ahead and buy this. High strength aluminum three-sectional staff for $79.95 from KarateMart.com. This looks virtually identical to what Jet Li uses in Fearless, so so this is gonna be perfect. Your enemies aren't gonna laugh when you've got a three section metal staff, that's for sure. This is a scary looking weapon here. Okay, so this is the middle piece. All right, here is the end piece. <laughs> this is shiny. They're extremely hard, but extremely light, which means you can do some really fast movements with it. Uh, I've got about a five inch chain here with swivel ball bearing, so here's one piece, uh, the middle piece, and then here's the third piece. Uh, the two end pieces have gripping on the ends, and then the middle piece has grippings on both ends. Now, guys, I have never used this weapon before. <laughs> I have no idea what the correct technique is. Do you hold it in the middle here? Do you hold it out here? I'm sure there's lots of different techniques, actually. It's extremely long. Let's see if it's, uh, yep, it's way taller than me. I think, gosh, it's probably over eight feet tall. So we want to have a big wide open space when we're spinning this around. I don't even know how I'm gonna hit some fruit with this. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Let's go outside and be like Jet Li. <laughs> have no fear because I am fearless. Oh, oh, good thing you didn't take a step forward there, V. Yeah. Almost swung you right wow. in the face there. What? 
Earth Wind Chimer can't hit me. Or oh, no. No. V, Harold, it's, it's a couple's weapon again. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's so romantic. We got, a, we got a lot of team weapons today. You guys are like the cutest couple ever. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. Are you guys trying to clothesline me? Are you trying to yeah. pull a, a, a face bang on me? Oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> v, you were saying that this looks like track and field. It's like the high jump. You know, you yeah. run and then you go. Just, okay, just here we go. run and jump over it. <laughs> Wow! You're flying through the air! Whoa! I made it! You are a true ninja! I totally made it! I'm a track ninja! Kickball! Kickball! <laughs> <laughs> or it's like a hurdle! So when, oh. I, when I'm running track and field and I jump over a hurdle, I ninja kick over it! Oh, heck yeah! yeah. Ninja kick hurdles! Ninja hurdles! Ninja yes. kick hurdles! Kick hurdle! <laughs> kick hurdle! I like kick yeah. hurdle! Or, or it can be a jump rope! Oh, oh hey! Yeah. One, two, two ninjas coming for you. Yes. Three, bounce, see four, bounce, four, kung fu, bounce, bounce, bang. Oh. oh, trash into the trash can. <laughs> so you said this is from Fearless with Jet Li. Yeah, you remember that movie? I love that movie. And Jet Li did it some amazing moves with this, which I am not going to be able to do because I've actually never used one of these before. Yeah. So if I attempt to spin this around, it's going to look pretty bad, guys. I know where my strengths are and where my weaknesses are. That's what a ninja knows, right, V? And you have a weakness for me, right? I have Aww. a weakness. I have a weakness for V. I just want to wrap her up in my weapon like this and trap her. Oh, what I'm... you gonna do now, V? What you gonna do? I huh? was talking about love, not no, like no, this. Heck, this is how I show my love. By never letting you leave. Ever. Yeah. Oh. We'll we'll have you train with those, and then maybe in the future sometime you can show us some moves. That's right. I'll practice and show you guys. <laughs> but in the meantime, I can certainly show you how it performs against a watermelon ninja. Heck yeah! Yeah! He's got a big old dent in his forehead here, oh, huh? He's already been in some battles. I see. Has, has he already met this thing or what? <laughs> Let's see if we can push his dent in a little further. Crouching tiger here. Yeah. Yeah. Crouching tiger! Kung Fu movie we are checking out is the movie Kill Bill. It certainly has some amazing Kung Fu in it, and it has a lot of amazing sword play in it. The famous Kill Bill Samurai Sword is the sword we're gonna be taking a look at. So KarateMart.com has the exact Kill Bill Samurai Sword for $54.95. This is gonna be very exciting to take a look at up close and personal and become like Kill Bill. Uh, and just wait a second, we're gonna go for a double weapon here, guys, because Kill Bill has another cool weapon in it. It has the chain maced used by Gogo Yubari. Probably remember her in her schoolgirl outfit wielding that chain swinging mace. Uh, and I did find a version of this. I couldn't find a real version, but I found this version right here. The Fun Costumes Women's Kill Bill Gogo Yubari Chain Mace for $14.99. So this is gonna be fun to have V wield this around. Let's order this and the Kill Bill sword and check them out. Oh, what a thrill it is. A sword from Kill Bill. Really nice looking. It's shiny black scabbard. Very cool devil head engraving there. Another engraving here with some kind of gold leaf inlet right there. Some silver colored metal with some engravings as well. A nice leather wrapped handle. Very long one, I might add. Let's check the sword out, huh? Ooh, it's like a brushed metal. That's cool. Usually you see a sword that's more of a like a shiny chrome metal, but this is definitely has a brushed chrome look. Oh wow! It has the engraving of that uh, the double head. I don't exactly know what that is, but uh, it's got a, that engraved right on the blade. That's really cool. Uh, is it sharp? Oh yeah, it's definitely sharp. I thought it'd be more of like a collector's item for a Kill Bill fan, but this is like a legit sword. This is gonna cut through uh, whatever we want actually. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it back in its very nice scabbard here, and we're gonna. Check out that next weapon, which is the Chain Mace Kill Bill Volumes 1 and 2 Gogo Yubari Chain Mace Accessory. I looked for the real thing of this, guys, and could not find it. I never did ask Karate Mart if they could find it for me. I'm sure they could probably find it if I would have asked them. It actually looks extremely similar to what was used in the movie, except for this one looks uh, a little bit more plasticky. So it's got the chains hanging on it here. It's got spikes. Okay, so it's got like a four foot chain. I can swing this baby around. <laughs> and crash right into you guys. <laughs> Let's go outside and have some fun with these things. Yeah. 
Chad, this guy looks like your twin. You're not gonna hurt your twin, are you? Well, you're right. He's wearing oh, the same hey. colors as me. Is he wearing Chad merch? He. You wearing a Chad Clay shirt? Chad uh, Wild Clay shirt? He's doing it because he's an imposter. He's trying yes. to infiltrate the clay, the clay clan. He's a clay clone. Clay clone in the clay clan. Are you me or am I you? Are you me? No, I'm you. Who are you? Who am I? You love it when we do that. <laughs> he doesn't love it when we do that. All right. Nice clean cut. Doesn't look like you anymore. No. It's raining soda. Woo! Whoa! Are we in the movie Kill Bill? Where are we? I'm Go Go. Ah, it's Go Go! And I'm Uma Thurman! Oh, Uma to the rescue. Here to save you, Justin. Oh, thank goodness. What do you got? Kill Bill's sword. Ooh, Bill's sword. That's scary. That is scary. Let's put it back in its sheath. Yeah. There we go. Let's scary. You know what's even scarier there? Look at this. I know. Go-Go's mace! Yeah, it is. Oh. Whoa, okay, cut that out. Okay, cut that out. It's scary for her. Cut, cut that out. Cut that out. I think she speaks an Asian language. Well, well give us a line in Vietnamese. Yeah, be Yeah, so go talk some smack to Chad. Let's talk some smack. Cái thằng chó kia! Shout out to all of you notification ninjas who get here quick and leave comments down below in the first hour of every upload. I'm featuring your guys' comments down here. Thank you so much for all the positivity and for the funny comments. I love hanging out with you guys in the comments, so thanks for being here. If you guys want any of the merch that I got, like this shirt right here, woo, you can go ahead and click in the top right hand corner right up here on that little eye symbol, or there's a link down below as well. And of course, huge shout out to KarateMarch.com who supplied me with all the weapons for this video. Use the code Wild clay and they're gonna give you 10% off your order. Put a link to them down below as well. Links to everything I'm using are all down below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and then if you haven't seen this video yet, check it out. It's an amazing Fruit Ninja video. If you're not subscribed to me, click right there. If you're not subscribed to me, click right there. Here is another amazing video. We have a lot of fun in that one, so definitely check both of these out. And I'll see you guys real soon with a brand new video. Kia!